Mezuno kituo cha kutokutabiri wa tabia nchi na mabadiliko ya hali ya hewa. Kituo hiki ambacho kitatoa habari muhimu kuhusu mabadiliko ya hewa katika mataifa yote moja ya IGAD kina makao makuu yake humu nchini katika eneo la Ngong Hills. Data kutoka kituo hiki itatumika na mataifa husika katika kufanya maamuzi bora hususan maamuzi kuhusu tabia nchi. Mwanahabari wetu la Mekaungo alikita kambi katika hafla hiyo ya uzinduzi na hii hapa taarifa yake. Katika katika mapambano dhidi ya tabia nchi Afrika haswa katika mataifa ya IGAD hii leo Rais Uhuru Kenyatta amezindua kituo cha utabiri wa hali ya hewa na utafiti wa tabia nchi. Kituo hiki ambacho kitakuwa na makao makuu yake humu nchini kitapiga jeki mataifa ya IGAD katika uratibu wa shughuli zao na kuwezesha pakubwa mapambano dhidi ya tabia nchi. Uhuru Kenyatta ni Rais wa Kenya. I am delighted to join you today in this auspicious occasion to officially open the EGAD Climate Prediction and Application Center. Indeed, Kenya is delighted to host this center of excellence on climate change. Ladies and gentlemen, climate change poses an existential threat to all of us in the Horn of Africa and indeed to the rest of the African continent. For example, research shows that the extreme interannual temperature and precipitation fluctuations here in Kenya account for about 50% of the variability in maize yields and water availability negatively impact public health and exasperate food insecurity. The inauguration of this facility, therefore, is a great leap forward for our work on climate change. It harnesses innovative technologies and knowledge to advance climate-related work initiated about three decades ago. Indeed, the establishment of this Intergovernmental Authority on Development, EGAD, and the EGAD Climate Prediction Application Center has been a response to the recurring doubt droughts and other natural disasters in our region. I also conclude by commending EGAD and the Climate and Prediction Application Center for the strong collaboration with the metrological services of member states in the EGAD region and with our partners. Akizungumza katika hafla hiyo katibu mkuu wa EGAD Dr. Wokine Gebejeu alisema kwamba kituo hiki kitasaidia pakubwa katika mapambano dhidi ya tabia nchi huku akisisitiza kwamba ipo haja ya mataifa kuungana na kuweka juhudi za uhalisia kudhibiti athari za tabia nchi na mchango wao kwa hali hii. Climate change is a problem because a global village we have been unable to agree on how to collectively address the problem. In other words, the weather is changing faster than the policies and actions we can formulate to respond to it. But perhaps the biggest obstacle we face in tackling climate change lies within ourselves. And this because it requires each one of us to make deliberate far-reaching changes in attitude, lifestyle, and perhaps even aspirations. As we speak, intense flooding has displaced over 700,000 people in South Sudan this year alone and affected over 6 million of us in this region last year. Remarkably, at the same time, severe drought is affecting Kenya, Ethiopia, and Somalia threatening the food security situation for the millions of our brothers and sisters in our region. Hivi sasa serikali pamoja na mashirika yasiyo kwa serikali yanatafuta mbinu pamoja na kuweka miundo mifumo ya kudhibiti athari za tabia nchi katika nchi yetu ya Kenya na hata kote Afrika hata ulimwengu. Na hivi sasa uzinduzi wa mahabara hii ambayo itashughulikia kutoa data ambayo itahakikisha kwamba kuna habari ya kutosha kwa mataifa husika ya IGAD ili kwamba yaweze kufanya maamuzi bora katika maswala ya tabia nchi itasaidia pakubwa sana ili kwamba kudhibiti athari za tabia ya inchi katika Afrika na hata katika ulimwengu. Lame Kaungo, Look Up TV, Gong Town.
Mam, huyo ni mwenzangu hapa tulinaye studio leo kaungwa ambaye alikuwa amevalia kinadhifu kabisa amependeza. Asante sana kwa taarifa hiyo nzuri la